Hey, and welcome to another beautiful summer day here in Seoul. Uh, my plan today is to go to Gyeongbokgung Palace, uh, have a look around there for the day. The weather's all right, it's sort of on and off raining, but I think it's gonna be okay. It should clear up a little bit later on, so hopefully I get to, you know, walk around and stay dry. All right, so I've just arrived in Gyeongbokgung. Uh, Weather's looking all right, it's looking okay. Uh, but first I need to get a drink to get my day started. All right, so I smashed this drink. That was a mango passion fruit crush. It's one of the most tasty things I've had like ever in my life. Um, there's two things I can never find in this city. One is a bin and the other one is public toilets. But anyway, um, look, well, I'm, I'm here. Like this is the palace kind of next to me. I just need to find my way in. Wow, this place is huge. Um, I'm pretty sure it's where they filmed that side film clip. But um, you know, it, the, the video doesn't do it justice for how big this place actually is. Uh, so if I was going to put together a list of things that you must do in Seoul, this is definitely one of them. Uh, it's amazing here, definitely worth coming. I don't know if it's like just because the weather's not that good, but there's there's not that many people here. It's it's great. Check it. Alright, and I've done a hell of a lot of walking today. Uh, this place is so big, so it's time for lunch. Thai for lunch, it's unreal. Um, I haven't had Thai food since I was in Thailand about three weeks ago, but excited for this. All right, that lunch was unreal. Uh, the weather looks a little bit sketchy, so I'm gonna head, there's a museum just down here, just near the palace. So I'm gonna go head there for a bit, get out, get out of this weather and check it out. That was unreal as well. I've uh, been having a great day, you know. I think I got really lucky with the weather. It hasn't rained yet, uh, but it's it's about to, I can tell. Uh, so I'm gonna head home, chill out for a little bit, and then probably head out later on for dinner again tonight. All right, so as you can see, the weather's pretty brutal again. Um, I don't really feel like going out, so I'm just gonna go to like 
convenience store and just get something easy that I can eat with, you know. Alright, that was another awesome day. I uh, really enjoyed the palace. It was, you know, even better than I expected. So, um, you know, great, great experience. And, and throughout this whole week, I've been doing like so many cool things uh, that haven't really cost me much money at all. So, look, to recap the day, I spent $2.50 on my juice this morning. I spent $3 on the entry into the palace. I uh, spent $5 on lunch. I uh, spent $2.70 on trains and $4 on dinner. Uh, so, total is $17.20. I went a little bit over the $14.30 or whatever it was for, for each day, but I've been saving money earlier in the week, so, you know, all, all in all, it works out okay. Um, and, and I'm on track for, you know, spending the $150 in a week, so awesome result. All right, and again, thanks for watching. Uh, tune in tomorrow for the last episode of this series, and then, you know, after that, I'll just be doing my regular vlogs, so subscribe if you haven't already, and stay tuned for more.